Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today I'm going to be going over 10 things you may not have known about Brick Hill, because there are lots of features, small, big, whatever, that lots of people, even myself, didn't know. So hopefully this video, like, helps you understand more about Brick Hill, and yeah, let's get on to number 10. So for the number 10 spot, we have, there are two currencies in Brick Hill, okay? There are bits and box. Bits being the smaller one and bucks being the bigger one. So for every bit you have, well, no, no, for every 10 bits that you have, you have one buck. So they're used to buy items for 10 bits, yeah, you have one buck. Um, items like shirts, pants, specials, any item in game you can buy, with, you have to buy with bits or bucks. Most items are, are on sale for bucks, but there are lots of good. Cheap bits ones you can buy for like you new players. So for the number nine slot, you have just ordinary items. Sorry, like shirts or pants or st stuff like that. Okay, the special items that Brick Hill themselves, not the players, but Brick Hill themselves, have to make limited. So, but basically these items you can trade. Okay, so you trade them with other users. Um, yeah, there's also a website called Brick Hill Trade, which is just generally all about the trade, tr like trading on Brick Hill. So it shows the values of the value of items, tips, richest people, scammers. Um, just gives you useful tips on how to trade. I really recommend it if you are if you are interested in trading. So for the number eight spot, we have they have Christmas and Halloween items, okay, items and events. So. In in Christmas, there's usually a special or two released. There's usually two or three gifts which can either be bought by the bought by the user, or they're earned by doing like mini games or puzzles or whatever. Um, there's usually one really expensive gift, and others are generally cheap. Um, they don't just release gifts; they release like lots of items, lots of old items, and sometimes even new items. Um, they do this for Halloween and Christmas, not just Christmas, but Halloween, in my opinion, because I've only been on Brick Hill for a year and I only got a bit of Christmas, it, like, Halloween is a lot better, okay? They release a lot cool items, um, and I really recommend uh, you go pick some up. R like, right now, there's Christmas items you can get for, like, really cheap, okay? Only one r new one really has been released, the Santa hat, which is only on sale for 10 bits, so, like, that's pretty cheap. Anyways, onto the number 10 spot, they, it is the... I mean, the number seven spot, sorry, is they have a Twitch. So, they don't stream every day. Um, they only stream, like, news. So, um, they did a Halloween stream, just talking about the new client, new items, what to, how to get free items, basically, for Halloween. Um, they also, sometimes they answer questions um, on stream. I'll put the link to their channel in the description. But it's basically just... I don't know, for fun, they don't really stream every day, every once in a while, which I still think is pretty cool, okay, like, it's still fun, although the streams aren't, like, well, like, they usually stuff up, but it's, it's still fun, anyways, from the number six spot, yes, they have a Twitter, um, but on the Twitter, they regularly post, probably, like, once every two weeks to a month, which I know may not be, sound like that much, but for something like that, it is a lot, okay, um, they regularly post, post stuff usually about recent news um they have also recently posted a teaser of the new client which i will link in the description of this video as well um the twitter that what well, yeah their twitter is called hill of bricks which um i don't have a twitter so i can't follow but if i did i would follow i do recommend you go check it out i'll link in the description of this video um, yeah, and on to the number fifth spot is they make blog posts. So, they don't have a separate website to do this. They just use their, like, they use Brick Hill, but it's a separate, um, like, separate part of Brick Hill. Um, yeah, they post news about events, like, the client, Halloween, Christmas, etc., and big things happening on the website. They've also recently been making blog posts about users that have helped out the community recently. So, um, like, game creators... Um, that's what I've done so far, is just spotlights of game creators, which I think is really cool, and I want them to do more of these, not just game creators, but just anybody who's helping the Brick Hill community. So, 
for the number spot, the number four spot. Sorry, we have they're working on a new client. Um, they are working on a new client because if you don't know, they the current client that they have is horrible for games. Like, it's really bad for games. Um, like even a loading game takes a while. The graphics suck. Frames suck. It's just not good for a game that wants to grow. Um, it will be released next year sometime. Um, Space said summer around in the US or UK, which that's winter in Australia, <laughs> by the way. Um, yeah, so they're working on a new client. It's going to be really, really cool. Um, I'll put some t photos on screen right now of what it could look like or what it looks like at the moment because they're still testing and creating it. Um, but yeah, it's really cool. Uh, yeah, just it's going to be really good. Like, there'll be lots more people in games, um, compared to now, which is, like, maybe two per game, which isn't a lot. So, hopefully the client will help Brickhill grow. And on to the number third spot is, you get a message from Brickhill when you sign up. Um, lots of players probably know this, but some people may not. Um, basically, it's, the, all the message is saying is, welcome to Brickhill, please follow the rules, go over the rules, and just have fun. We want Brickhill to be a safe environment for everyone. I'll put a screenshot on screen, um, of it, uh, yeah, it's just, it's from Brickhill, like, the official account, it's just a bot that sends it, but I still think it's really cool, and it's definitely something to not, like, try to get rid of, or, oh no, you can't get rid of messages, but, like, not try to forget, because it's pretty cool. Anyways, so, for the number, second thing, you may not have known about, Brick, uh, about Brickhill, because Brickhill, most people use Brickhill as a forum, website or just to collect items or talk to people etc but it is there there's games you can play yes there are games you can play but they are really bad in my opinion and lots of other users think this because the client is not good enough um it isn't worth it in my opinion to make a game until the new client comes out which i am want like i want other users maybe a user that can code to help me i can do the design um if you're interested in that just send me a message on brick hill but, yeah, um, I'll definitely be playing more games, definitely, when the client releases, because it looks really good, like, almost as good as Roblox's, so, yeah, um, so, yeah, every time someone plays a game, you get one bit, I've already talked about this, but for game developers, like, especially the most visited game, I believe, has 10,000 visits, so that's, like, a thousand, but, yeah, that's a thousand bucks, that's pretty good, um, yeah, so, in my opinion, the games aren't horrible, but they could be a lot, lot, lot better, okay? And for the number first spot is, there used to be, well, yeah, there used to be two people that own Brick Hill, okay? There's only one, sadly, Brick Loot died, 2018, I believe, like, yeah, late 2018. Um, I'm not going to talk about it, but, yeah, he and Space helped well not really helped but created brick hill and he died and may he rest in peace and hopefully brick hill can become what he would want it to be and yeah so thank you guys so much for watching this video i know this is a very long video to you to the video to the videos i usually make and sorry my speech is bad it's just i don't know i i'm just tired anyways Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Smash like, subscribe, comment down below exactly what you want me to do next. Um, and if you want to do a collab with me on Brickhill or anything, send me a message. Put a comment on YouTube. Anyways, see ya.